Hello everyone, welcome to Wine Made Easy TV. Today is lesson number nine and we're going to finish the rest of France, namely Alsace, Rome and the Loire Valley. Now, Alsace, let's start with that. Alsace is on the northeastern part of France, it's bordering with Germany. This particular area has seen a lot of back and forth between French occupation and German occupation. So it's learned the best of both worlds of in terms of winemaking. Alsace focuses mainly on two particular grapes, which are Riesling and Gewurztraminer. Rieslings when the, from Alsace are a little bit more high in alcohol and also got some more sturdiness to it compared to the German Rieslings as well, which has a completely different taste profile. And the Alsace Riesling is also more dry, which is, it means, when I say dry, that means less sweet, all right? And also there's Gewurztraminer. Gewurztraminer is uh, one of my most favorite grapes out there for white wine. Gewurztraminer, I know the name sounds very confusing, but it's an outstanding wine if you can get it. Normally how you can recognize an Alsatian bottle is also from this unique style of bottle compared to other white wines. As you can see, Alsace bottles and German bottles as well have this nice and long slender shape to it. And uh, they really stand out over there. Now, Gewurztraminer. Gewurztraminer is very floral, it's very spicy as well on some of its notes and it's a wonderful, wonderful companion with Indian food and also spicy food in general. Alright, now let's move on to one of my most underrated regions which is there, Rhone. Rhone Valley is unique. Rhone Valley has a very, very strong focus on the grape Syrah and Grenache. Rhone is split into two. There's Northern Rhone and Southern Rhone. Both regions focus very strongly on Syrah, but Southern Rhone has more focus on Grenache. So Northern Rhone, the regions to take notice is the Hill of Hermitage, Cotroti and Condru. And Southern Rhone, where there's more Grenache, there's a very famous region as well, part of Southern Rhone, which is my favorite, Chateauneuf du Pape, which is a very, very strong focus on Grenache, but it's also got 13 different grapes in it. When you taste the Chateau Neuf du Pape, it is very balanced, but it's got a lot of different bell pepper and green olive sort of notes also going along with it. Whereas in the northern Rhone part, the Syrah made over there is spicy. Remember, Syrah is a medium bodied grape, but Syrah also is renowned for its very, very strong spicy notes, black pepper, olives, and whereas the Grenache has more spicy with some little bit of lighter uh, red fruits as well going along with it. And in terms of white wine in Rhone, there's also the famous Bionier grape, which has some honey, nutmeg, cinnamon flavors going along with it. The most popular producers from Rhone is M. Chapoutier, E. Gugal, and Augier. And finally, Loire Valley. Loire is more in the northern part of France, and this region focuses on Sauvignon Blanc, which is one of the lightest white wines, and Cabernet Franc, which is one of the heaviest of red wines. So you can see two major extremes are being produced in this region. The Sancerre region and the Puy Fumé region of Loire is one where the best Sauvignon Blancs are coming from there. It's more light, it's got a lot, lot of white lilies and flower, flower petals in it, and it's also got a nice little hint of flint and smoke from it. Now the Cabernet Franc, which is a, the hardest and the most blackest of red wines out there, that has a lot of black pepper, full bodied olive. It's really a man's wine over there. It's not jumping with fruit, but it's really got some bite to it, some leather, some really dark chocolate as well. And also, let's not also forget, there's another white grape which Loire Valley specializes in, mainly called Chenin Blanc. You will find it in the town of Vouvray. It's very uh, light with honey, lemon, and peach. But definitely, Loire Valley is more popular for its Sancerre Sauvignon Blancs. All right? That's it, we're done with France for now and tune in next time for our more focus on different regions of it. Till then, cheers.